I get it. Property prices can be ridiculous these days with the average price in Sydney being over a million dollars. What we need to think about when we are trying to overcome our fear of whether the price is too high or not is to think about it logically. Um, step one might be we might want to do the hard slog and live where we want to in Sydney. Uh, number two is that we may have family to help us out um, with our deposit and things. And there's a couple other videos that you'll find that are on low to limited deposit or um, how borrowing power works in conjunction with the deposit. Or the other one is that there's a common thread out there that we combine words together like rent where you want to be and invest in property. And that can achieve the same thing because then we have the best of both worlds. We can buy a property in a different area that's at a lower price. Uh, we could invest in another area that's um, where, where we may want to end up in the future. Or we can invest in an area where we can get some money back off the property, maybe have some growth in the property and be able to combine those two things together to be able to buy a property in a place that may be a little bit higher in dollars than what we are thinking now. So we could rent where we want to be uh, in a house that we potentially can't afford in Sydney, for example. We could then rent, um, uh, look at saving up a small deposit to buy something a little bit cheaper in a different state or regionally or elsewhere that will help us build up a deposit and keep moving forward. A caution on this one, um, there's a lot of hype in regards to whether it's negative geared, positive geared, and I'll do another video on those later on but the right property is the best situation you need. You need something that's gonna provide you income every single week. We need something that's going to be in your budget, um, something that is achievable and something that you can target and get a goal towards saving a deposit. Now, if you wanna have a look at any of these options, just reach out, reply to email, check the videos out, comment, whatever you need to do to get in touch with me, more than happy to provide that information. Uh, no obligation required. All right, have a great day.